You see, everybody do tuna push today for 30 days. Literally everyone around me tried it. Mr. Rock, can you please stop? And so did we a year ago, but there's one thing people kept commenting about. Rest. And that's obviously true. Or is it? And we have the perfect beginner, Leonard, my cameraman. He just transformed his body in 90 days. He has no clue, but today we're challenging him to do a more optimal version of the infamous push-up challenge. That's why I challenge you to do two the push-ups today for 30 days straight. It's a bit different, but are you ready to take on the challenge? <laughs> sure. <laughs> you accept the challenge? Okay. Start uh, whatever you want. <laughs> he started right away. This is what it looks like on day one, and we'll compare that to day 30. His weight is 76.5 kilograms, 168 pounds. His chest is 102.5 centimeters. His right arm is 32 centimeters, and his left arm is also 32 centimeters. But there's something Leonard doesn't know. There's another contestant. My name is Luke. I'm 18 years old. This is Luke. He has some workout experience, and we'll be doing the original version of this challenge. He also has no clue. How many push-ups do you think you can do in a row? 30. 35. I challenge you to do two in a push today for 30 days straight. Oh, you yeah, in? I'm in. Okay, I'm in. you're in. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yes. His weight is 71.6 kilograms, 158 pounds. He's a bit shorter than Leonard. His chest is 96 centimeters. His right arm is 31 centimeters. And his left arm is 30 33 centimeters. What? Day one of the push-up challenge. Let's see how many push-ups you can do in a row. And then right away, you're gonna finish the two in a push as fast as possible. Time starts. Now, we picked these two guys because we thought their push-up level would be quite similar. And funny enough, they're both max push-ups is... Oh, 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 oh. 30 to 35! 35! <laughs> oh, 35! Go ahead! Is there... No! <laughs> okay, so, the time continues right now and you're one minute in, which means that you gotta finish the tuna push-ups right now. I do want to tell you that every rep you do more on day 30 is worth 10 bucks. <laughs> Alright, so while they're doing their tuna push as fast as possible, the guy with the pizza shirt has to do tuna push ups each day for 30 days straight. That's the only rule. Tuna push today for 30 days straight. That's all the information you get. But the guy with the Gymshark shirt has a plan. Rule one, he has to do push-ups every other day. This should give him around 48 hours of rest. And two, he has to do all the push-ups in one workout. Five sets of push-ups. Don't go all out, but they should be challenging. Stopping when you have around one to three reps left in the tank. After these five sets, there's one more set of max push-ups. You have no rep left. And rest should be around 90 to 120 seconds. Research shows that doing more than six sets per muscle group in a day will not necessarily give you more gains. And on day 15, we'll have a check-in and see if they're actually still alive. All right, so they're both <laughs> Having a pretty rough time finishing the two in the push ups. That's it. 21 minutes and 39 seconds. Last one. Yes, you did it. Oh, stop the time. Stop the time. It is 31.15. Oh, and not to forget, they both have no clue of each other's existence in this challenge. And they literally live 100 meters away from each other. There are a million ways this could go wrong. We do this so they don't see this as a competition. So no contact with each other during these 30 days is key to make the results count. Let's see how much gains you make. I just woke up. I'm feeling really sore. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, so I'm now gonna do my first 100 push ups. So it's the second day, and I do feel pretty sore in my shoulders, so I'm happy I can rest today. But tomorrow, I will do my first proper push only workout. I'm gonna do my next 50 push ups in between work. So, this is our first problem. This is Ghost, Luke's best friend. He is transforming his body in 90 days right now, and you guessed it, Leonard is working on this documentary. So, if he talks with Leonard about Luke's challenge, it's over. And this will be a very hard challenge, to say the least. Oh, and Ghost also lives like a few hundred meters away from both of these guys. I can definitely still feel some pain from day one. So, 25 is a pretty big set for me. But yeah, 90 days ago, my record was 15 push-ups in a row, so... So with Leonard's plan, he ends up doing between 120 and 140 reps per workout, which on average only ends up being 60 to 70 push-ups per day. Luke was definitely getting more and more creative with where he was doing the push-ups. I'm at a perfect 40, so I'm gonna do another 20 push-ups, and it's making me... That's 10. Let's go, come on. How do you feel? Sure. Sure. Yeah. <laughs> they both also kept doing their normal workouts, but of course for push, they only did the push-ups. And they're both eating around maintenance and getting enough protein in every single day. They are enjoying their protein pancakes, protein bars, clear whey, and much, much more that you can check out right now on my protein website. First link in the description and make sure you check out with code brownie. Sick discounts. And now on day five, I noticed that throughout the day, my strength is reducing because you don't get a rest day, of course. The motivation is now what keeps me going because my muscles they pretty much want to stop. But yeah, let's go for the next 100. 
I saw the footage, I only did 90. So now I'm gonna do my last 10. I won't cheat. So what's our guess? Well, for muscle mass, we 100% agree with the comments and think that more rest equals more gains. But for who will see the most progress with push-ups, well, from our experience, the more you do an exercise, the better you get at it. And because Luke will be doing so many more reps than Leonard, compare his 200 a day to Leonard's like 60 a day, that's an insane difference. So we think Luke will actually see more progress. Yes, rest is also very important when it comes to performance. So. I'm happy this challenge actually has a structure instead of just doing 200 push-ups every day. Luke was not able to finish the push-ups on only one of these 30 days. I got migraine. I am not gonna be able to do 200 push-ups today, sadly. I'm kinda bummed about it because I really thought it was going all so well. Okay, so I am sick right now, but Let's make this a bit more fun. Hey, what's up, Leonard? I'm sick today, so I'm sorry I can't be there. Oh, I don't need to forget this this part. This part is very important. Hey, what's up, Luke? All right, let's get to editing. Hey, what's up, Leonard? Hey, what's up? Hey, what's up, Luke? Let's see if they're still alive and if they still don't know about each other. Yo, what's up, man? What's, what's up? up? You ready for today? How is it going, Uh I think it's okay. Going fine. How's the soreness? The last. 14 days, I felt a lot of soreness. And how many push-ups do you expect to, to do today? I don't expect to improve my maximum push-up. Okay, so I have something for you. The video message. Oh, damn. Hey, what's up, Luke? Hey, what's up, Leonard? I'm sick today, so I'm sorry I can't be there. But today is a very big day, and we'll be putting you to the test. I'm expecting a lot from you, so good luck, and uh, make sure to uh, drink your water, and don't forget to smash like, subscribe, and hit bell. <laughs> You heard it. Nice. Okay, so with this motivation, let's go and do some push-ups. Are you ready? Let's make it, man. Let's see. Let's go. One, two. The results are very interesting to say the least. 38? Oh, that's it. Oh, that's, that's it. nice, my man. We also let them finish their tuna push-ups, and also their time was interesting. But only 15 days. Better than I expected already. This is promising for day 30. They still had no clue about each other. And after Arjen's visit to Leonard, he literally walked to Luke and recorded the exact same clips. Literally the exact same. Great job, my man. I'm very proud of you. Keep this up until day 30, and I'm sure you have the best results out of everybody who did this challenge. Let's go. This this is your phone. Yeah, it is. It's, thank you. This is your phone, right? Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Here you go. Okay, thank you. Bye. 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 I have to do 100 push-ups only in half an hour before 12. I was watching. <laughs> New video, Stan. With Leonard uh, doing his... Mind the body transformation, Leonard. It's insane, looking really good. It gives me a bit extra motivation to keep going every day. All right, small update on the push-ups. I think it's going all right. Today was definitely a bit easier than the day before yesterday. I'm just doing it and sometimes forget to film it, but 10 days left. So we had a few recording days coming up with Coase and Leonard at the same time. We found it too risky to just see what happens. So we wanted to tell Coase everything about the challenge and make sure he doesn't mention anything. But then he showed up with an unexpected guest. Both of them are here. One of them is Luke. Well, I'm here, I'm here. I'm here. Good luck with the push-ups. Okay, that sucked. That, that sucked, yeah. We're now having a big risk that Luke will actually find out. So a few days later, we wanted to try again. All right, so Coase is about to get here. And I want to tell him something, but I also already see someone else. Yo. Today you will be shot by Leonard and me. Yeah. And Luke is here as well. Yeah. But what you can't discuss today is that they are doing the same challenge. I heard because I saw Leonard yesterday in the, yeah. in the store. In the store? And he told me about it. Oh. I thought about Luke accidentally. Oh, I no. didn't know. No way. Yeah. We wanted to tell you last time, but then you brought Luke out of nowhere. Luke doesn't know. No. But we're like a few days away. So let's just try to keep Luke out of this. I think he's actually here. So he's spoiled about Luke. He's I saw him yesterday in the supermarket. Shh, shh. Luke doesn't know. Okay, but why? I guess they didn't want to tell us so we don't look at it as a competition. 
But if you know me personally, you know that the only one that I'm competing against is myself. So I don't see it as a problem. It actually turned out to be a good thing that Leonard knows because Luke kept talking about his challenge the entire day. So then they would have both known by now. Whew, what a journey. How did the challenge go? First week was just incredibly sore. Yeah, it was okay. Yeah, my motivation was really high, so that wasn't the issue. Felt like it went by pretty fast as well. I mean, it's basically 15 workouts. Would you like to have had a rest day in those 30 days? No. You wouldn't want to do half of this, for example. No. Do you think you gained muscle? So I don't think there is that much of a difference in 30 days. I think so, yeah. I guess we'll have to see. Check out the results. Luke's weight went from 71.6 kilograms to 70.7 kilograms. His chest went from 96 centimeters to 96 centimeters. Luke's right arm went from 31 centimeters to 31 centimeters. And his left arm from 33 centimeters to 33 centimeters. Basically everything stayed the same, but you lost weight. So that's progress. Leonard's weight went from 76.5 kilograms to 76.8 kilograms. But did he gain muscle? I, I mean, he looks a bit leaner as well. But is there a difference? Let's find out. <laughs> Leonard's chest went from 103 centimeters to 105 centimeters. My man! Whoa! Leonard's arms went from 32 centimeters to 32 centimeters. Both of them stayed the same. So let's check out where I think you will really shine the push-ups. On day one, you did 35 push-ups in a row and you did the tuna push-ups in 21 minutes and 36 seconds. I think I'm gonna go for at least 40 push-ups. Five reps more is big. You seem confident. I am. Are you ready? I'm ready. Go. Proper form. Oh. 35, 36, come on. 37. Come on. 38, come on, come on. Come on. 39. Come, come on. on, one more, come on. 40, come, come on, on, come on, keep pushing. 40, come on! Oh. 38, 39, nice. keep that 40. 40. Dave was 41. 42, 43, Damn. 44, 45, keep it up. 46, come on. 47, come on. Oh! That's 12 points, you were flying. I expected to do just a bit more, man. But the time is still ticking. Yes. And you gotta finish those 200 pushes. Then there you go, stop the time. All right, and done. 60 minutes and 54 seconds. You basically got twice as good in push-ups. Luke has not had any rest before this. So 48 hours later, we gave them a second shot. And oh yeah, Luke still has no clue about Leonard. <laughs> We're about to tell him. Today we have a cameraman. Leonard, he comes. So we're going to professional today, man. Tell him. Go. One, two, yes, proper reps. Oh, oh We're gonna take Fridays today and you just earned 120 bucks. 200 every day? 200 push ups every day, That's yeah. That's pretty sick. You increased uh, quite a lot. Okay, I'll have to admit that I'm kind of playing around here with Leonard knowing that Luke has no clue. Yeah, it was intense, but fun to do. <laughs> was it fun though? Every day? What? Yes! 15.35. Now it was time to tell him. There's only one thing I forgot to mention is this guy right next to you also did a 30 day push up challenge, but he did an optimized version. Oh shit. <laughs> you had no clue, right? No. <laughs> Go. One, two, yes, three. 40. Come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on, come on. 41. Come on, come on, come on. Let's go. Let's go. Oh. Come on, man. One. And there you go! You beat your time! Yes. Our guess that Luke would see more results in push-ups definitely shows, but they both have very good results. So for the body results, Luke definitely looks leaner and maintained his mass very well while losing a kilogram. Leonard's chest looks noticeably better and fuller. Muscle-wise, he did at least as good as Luke, if not better, for less than half the work. Let us know in the comments down below which version you would try. So, should you do it and which version? They both have pretty good results. Well, the original version is all right. It will build your muscle and it will definitely make you a lot stronger, but it's definitely not optimal and there's a higher risk of injury. So going for Leonard's option seems to me like the superior option, especially if you consider the number one most important factor for gains, which is staying consistent for way longer than 30 days. Oh, and if you want a full workout program and support the channel, listen to what Leonard has to say. And today is your day to start the 90 day workout <laughs> challenge. Get in shape before summer. <laughs> <laughs>